Hi everybody, my name is Evan Linanetti and I am the Salmon Trout Enhancement Biologist for the Oregon Department of Fish and Wildlife here in the Umpqua. Unfortunately, with the COVID-19 situation we're in right now, we don't have any of our eggs to fry setups out in classrooms, which means a lot of students are missing out on the opportunity to learn a little more about salmon and steelhead. So today, here at the Roseburg ODFW office, we have a fish eggs to fry setup. And this fish eggs to fry setup, we already have hatched out Alvin which we brought these uh, fish here a few weeks ago, but they hatched out pretty quickly, and we'll show you some video of that as well. But first, I want to just kind of go over the setup that we have so that you're familiar with what the tank looks like. So here we have a 20-gallon standard fish tank aquarium. An important part here is the thermometer. So we keep a really close eye on the temperature. It might be hard to see there, but we have it at set about 50 degrees. So that's a primo temperature for salmon and steelhead. In the back here, if you take the lid off, we can see that we have a filtration system that removes some of the contaminants from the water. And then a pump that's pumping water into a chilling system in the back that's kind of hard to see back there. And then the return water comes back nice and chilled, again at that 50 degree temperature. And then we also set some gravel in the bottom. And it's more just so that the eggs have some place to rest and the fish have some place to rest so that they don't move around too much, but it also kind of mimics the natural environment in which they would be. So if you can see there, you saw some of the alevin that are in there, the alvin that are in there, and they're at that stage right now, they're just freshly hatched out not too long ago, and they're in the wild, they would be nestled in between the gravel, so they'd be kind of tucked within there. So throughout this series, we're hoping to do a couple different videos for you guys over the next month or so. In about a month, they'll be ready to release, but throughout that time, we'd like to show you how they're developing, what the stages are, show you how the fish are changing throughout time, and kind of give you an idea what their, how their behavior changes, how their looks differ, and show you a little bit more about the program. There's a lot of good educational information on ODFNW's website in the Fish, Eggs, and Fry section. There you can find out all sorts of activities and art projects and math projects for kids to do while they're uh, following along with these videos.